if they've had a listing appointment and there's really no follow-up afterwards or it's very you know sort of short and pithy not substantive that would be a red flag to me because mm -hmm. that's probably how they're going to respond to other buyers and oh, yeah. communication with the seller it needs to be consistent as well so if it doesn't start out of the gate well that's tough um mm -hmm. red flags might also be Sometimes you have very like big top producing agents. Sometimes they have so many assistants that they depend on that they're not as hands-on. So I want to make sure that if I am whomever that I'm hiring, you know, mm. assistants are fine, you know, whatever, but like make sure they're hands-on in this process. And it's just not one of many. And um, the last thing I would say is and this is totally counterintuitive, I'm sure, but uh, sellers should be wary of agents who are willing to cut their commissions just like that. 